Congressman Marlon Stutzman has shot a letter over to the president of Beretta USA in an effort to bring the Maryland-based company to northeast Indiana. This move would bring in about 400 jobs. News Channel 15's Lamar Holiday is here to explain why the company is considering leaving Maryland. Lamar? Yeah, Mark and Heather, there's legislation making its way through the Maryland General Assembly that would ban assault rifles, which Beretta makes. Congressman Stussman is inviting Beretta to bring its U.S. headquarters right here to Indiana, saying he'll welcome the company with open arms, but others are not so welcoming. Two sides, one issue. Gun control has been a hot-button item in politics since the Newtown, Connecticut shooting. In Maryland, lawmakers are looking to ban assault rifles and limit magazine capacity, which could affect Beretta. That legislation could cause this 500-year-old company to pack up and move. Why not invite them to Indiana? Uh, those are jobs. They're uh, great uh, uh, corporate uh, neighbors to the community. That invitation was in the form of a letter, and there seems to already be interest. We've already heard from folks in Huntington. Uh, we've heard from folks in uh, Kosciuszko County. We've heard from folks, um, you know, from other counties. But an opponent of this idea believes this is just a way of Beretta blackmailing Maryland. They don't like the policy that's being discussed. They're threatening to leave the state and uh, bring 400 jobs or whatever with them. Paul Helmke, former president of the Brady campaign to prevent gun violence, says he's all for gun rights, but says this is the wrong move for Indiana. I don't think that's his job uh, to be uh, dictating, uh, uh, letting a company dictate gun policy for, for our state or for, for any other state. There are other states interested in luring Beretta. Congressman Stussman says he has not actually spoken to anyone from the company, and Beretta did not return our calls. To see the letter the congressman sent to the company's president, visit this story on Wayne.com. In Studio 15 tonight, Lamar Holiday, News Channel 15.